beautiful. Today I'm going to be talking about Egyptology of the Torah, and how a little bit of knowledge on hieroglyphs can really, really, really help us in our understanding of the Torah and the stories there, and how a little bit of knowledge on hieroglyphs can actually show us kind of like corroborations. I wouldn't say actual things that are proved because you know the Torah is a mix of myth and historical reality. You know, it's going to be written from a Jewish perspective to serve the Jewish people, even though not everyone in the Torah is a Jew, right? We have the Israelites, and then after the um, northern kingdom of Israel falls, and we have the Ten Lost Tribes, that's when, you know, the Israelites kind of, like, coalesce into the Jewish people. That's when you really focus on the tribes of Judah, the tribes of Benjamin and Judah, right? In the southern kingdom of Judah. So, 